Hello, this is John Robinson, and I'm here to get you ready for college. I think I might make this a little series. I'm not sure. Uh, see how this works out, and we'll just see how it works out. Okay, uh, thing I noticed is that I have a lot of clothes that I don't wear anymore, but I also want to buy new clothes for college. So, um... Like I said, I'm going into, I haven't said it, uh, I'm going into my sophomore year at Ursinus College. That is property of Ursinus College. You've probably never heard of it. It's pr definitely all right if you haven't. Nobody's heard of it anyway. So, um, yeah, by the way, Ursinus College, really nice college. But uh, today, I'm going through all my clothes. As you can see right here, those clothes are going to college definitely um i also have some regular just t-shirts and stuff over here but these clothes especially that bandana i have not worn or just do not fit in it anymore i've also have a big uh trash bag of other clothes that i already went through from my closet and i just feel that it's definitely necessary to purge, to cleanse, and to get through these things. I actually organized my sock drawer. Wee, that was fun. Um, no, it wasn't. <laughs> that was terrible. Anyway, it just seems that, and send it to a good cause. The, I mean, I think everybody should go through their clothes to get ready for their new ones, because if not, you just pile up, and then it just never gets done. Uh, send your clothes to the Salvation Army or a local um, thrift store, and they'll gladly take them. Really nice. Don't do underwear or socks. That's nasty. Um, by the way, all these socks are do not match. All of them. Just I have like six different types of pairs of socks. It's weird. And ooh, this is my only actual pair. I'm more of a British guy, but of boxers and it's really weird because it says um support the your sinus annual fund i supported the fund because we were supposed to be setting a world record for most people in underpants um slash like you know they have the t-shirt on and stuff there's technicalities and everything but we were supposed to set a world record but the date never happened they just were like here give us money and we'll give you these boxers and then we'll all be in the Guinness Book of World Records. I was like, that's cool. But they never did. So they just scam my college scammed me out of an extra ten ten to twenty dollars. I I think it was ten dollars because I wouldn't have paid twenty dollars for that. Um so yeah, clothes are definitely necessary for college, duh. And uh, definitely get your new ones for college, but don't forget to get rid of the ones that you aren't going to wear because somebody else will wear them. Uh, it's just the way it goes. And that's all I have right now.